In the heart of Japan, a proverb echoes with timeless wisdom. Yuen momu karaluo chiru. Even monkeys fall from trees. It paints a simple yet powerful image. We envision a creature, agile and adept at navigating the branches, suddenly losing its grip and tumbling to the ground. This imagery transcends the literal. It speaks to a fundamental truth about the human experience. Everyone makes mistakes, no matter how skilled or knowledgeable they may be. This proverb is not meant to discourage us. It is a gentle reminder that we are all on a journey of learning and growth. We are all students in the school of life. And in this school, mistakes are not failures, but rather opportunities for growth. They are stepping stones on the path to mastery. The proverb invites us to embrace our imperfections. It encourages us to view our mistakes with compassion, both for ourselves and others. It is a call to approach life with humility, knowing that even the most experienced among us can stumble. Monkeys in their natural habitat are masters of their domain. They swing effortlessly through the trees, their agility and grace a testament to years of practice. They navigate the intricate network of branches with an expertise honed by instinct and experience. We too strive for mastery in our chosen fields. We dedicate years to honing our skills, accumulating knowledge, and perfecting our craft. We seek to emulate the monkey's confidence, its effortless mastery of its environment. But the proverb reminds us that even the most skilled monkey can experience a misstep. No matter how much we practice, how much knowledge we acquire, we are all susceptible to error. This is not a cause for despair, but rather a call for humility. It is a reminder that our expertise, however impressive, should never make us immune to self-reflection and a willingness to learn from our mistakes. The tree, in the context of the proverb, represents the challenges and obstacles we encounter in life. Each branch, each twist and turn of the trunk, symbolizes a new experience, a new test of our abilities. Life, like a sprawling tree, offers both opportunities for growth and unexpected challenges. There will be times when we navigate these challenges with ease, our confidence soaring as we ascend towards our goals. But there will also be moments when we lose our footing. We may encounter unexpected obstacles, make miscalculations, or simply find ourselves overwhelmed by the complexities of the path ahead. These are the moments when we are reminded of the monkey's fall. They are the moments when we must dig deep, tap into our resilience and find the strength to get back up and continue our climb. The image of the monkey falling is a powerful reminder of the universality of mistakes. No one is immune to error. From the novice taking their first tentative steps to the seasoned expert at the pinnacle of their career, everyone stumbles at some point in their journey. Mistakes are an inherent part of the human experience. They are woven into the very fabric of our existence. To err is human, as the old adage goes, and it is in those moments of error that we have the opportunity to learn, grow, and evolve. The key is not to avoid mistakes entirely, for that is an impossible task. Rather, it is to approach our mistakes with a spirit of curiosity and a willingness to learn from them. When we view our errors as opportunities for growth, we transform them from setbacks into stepping stones. The proverb encourages us to shift our perspective on mistakes. It teaches us that they are not something to be ashamed of, but rather an inevitable part of the learning process. Section 5. Rising from the Forest Floor. Embracing Our Falls. In the heart of the forest, where the ground is covered with fallen leaves and the air is filled with the scent of earth, we find the perfect metaphor for our journey. The proverb doesn't end with the monkey's fall. It continues, suggesting a deeper narrative. It implies the monkey's ability to recover, to learn from its mistake, and to climb again. Each climb is a testament to its resilience and determination. This is where the true essence of the proverb lies, in the resilience we show after a fall. It's not just about the fall itself, but about the strength we muster to rise again. Embracing our falls begins with accepting that they are a natural part of life. Just as the seasons change, so too do our circumstances. It's about silencing the inner critic that magnifies our errors and instead adopting a growth mindset. This mindset allows us to see beyond the immediate pain of failure. This means viewing mistakes as opportunities for learning and development, rather than as personal failures. Each mistake is a stepping stone on the path to success. 
Resilience is about getting back up, dusting ourselves off, and trying again, this time with the wisdom gleaned from our experience. It's about perseverance and the relentless pursuit of our goals. It's about understanding that each fall, each misstep, brings us closer to mastery, even if it doesn't feel like it at the time. Every challenge faced and overcome adds to our strength. The proverb is a powerful reminder that our strength is not defined by our ability to avoid falling, but by our courage to rise each time we do. It's about the journey, not just the destination. It's a call to action urging us to embrace our falls, learn from them, and emerge stronger and wiser. Just as the cherry blossoms bloom after a harsh winter, so too can we flourish after our falls. To section 6. A helping hand, empathy, in the face of failure. The proverb not only speaks to our own experiences, but also encourages us to view the mistakes of others with empathy and understanding. Just as we stumble and fall, so too will those around us. Instead of judgment or criticism, we should offer a helping hand, just as we would hope for one to be extended to us. When we see someone struggling, remember the image of the monkey losing its grip. Remember that everyone makes mistakes, that even the most skilled among us can stumble. Offer support, not scorn. Encourage, don't demoralize. By cultivating empathy for the mistakes of others, we foster a more compassionate and supportive environment for everyone to learn and grow. We create a space where it's safe to stumble, to fall, and to get back up again, stronger and wiser for the experience. Remember, the next time you see someone falter, extend a hand of understanding, offer encouragement and support, and remind them that even monkeys fall from trees. Section 7, Wisdom from the Treetops, Applying the Proverb to Life. The wisdom of even monkeys fall from trees extends far beyond the rainforest canopy. It serves as a gentle reminder that no one is infallible, and even the most skilled can make mistakes. Its lessons resonate in every aspect of our lives, from our personal relationships to our professional endeavors. This ancient saying teaches us humility and the importance of resilience. In our personal lives, the proverb reminds us to be patient with ourselves and those we love. It encourages us to accept imperfections and to understand that growth often comes through overcoming challenges. We are all works in progress, constantly learning and evolving. Each mistake is an opportunity to learn something new and to improve ourselves. Mistakes are inevitable, but they do not define us. They are merely stepping stones on our journey towards mastery and self-improvement. What matters is how we respond to them. Do we let them discourage us, or do we use them as fuel to drive us forward? In the workplace, embracing this proverb can foster a culture of continuous improvement. It encourages employees to take initiative and to not fear failure. By creating a safe space for employees to learn from their mistakes, organizations can unlock innovation and creativity. This environment nurtures a sense of belonging and trust. When we are not afraid to fail, we are more likely to take risks and explore new possibilities. This can lead to groundbreaking ideas and advancements. In education, embracing this proverb encourages a growth mindset in students. It teaches them that failure is not the end, but a part of the learning process. By shifting the focus from grades to learning, educators can create an environment where students feel empowered to experiment, make mistakes, and grow. This approach fosters curiosity and a love for learning. The applications of this proverb are limitless. It can be applied to any situation where growth and learning are involved. Its message is universal. Embrace your mistakes, learn from them, and never stop growing. This timeless wisdom can guide us through life's many challenges and triumphs. Section 8. The Journey Continues. Embracing Growth and Resilience. As we reflect on the wisdom of even monkeys fall from trees, let us remember that life itself is a journey of continuous learning and growth. Each day presents us with new opportunities to expand our horizons and deepen our understanding. There will be times when we soar through the canopy with grace and ease, feeling invincible and confident. And there will be times when we lose our grip and fall, feeling vulnerable and uncertain. But it is in those falls, those moments of perceived failure, that we have the greatest opportunity to learn and evolve. These experiences teach us resilience and the importance of perseverance. It is in picking ourselves up, dusting ourselves off and climbing back up the tree that we discover our true strength and resilience. Each attempt makes us stronger and more determined. 
So let us embrace the journey with all its twists and turns, its triumphs and its stumbles. Every path we take, every obstacle we face, shapes us into who we are meant to be. Let us approach each new challenge with a spirit of curiosity and a willingness to learn. By doing so, we open ourselves to endless possibilities and growth. And let us never forget the wise words of the Japanese proverb, even monkeys fall from trees. This timeless wisdom reminds us that no one is perfect, and that is perfectly fine. It is a reminder that we are all human. We all make mistakes, and that's okay. What truly matters is how we respond to those mistakes and what we learn from them. What matters is that we keep climbing, keep striving, and keep believing in our ability to overcome any challenge that comes our way.